This is your three-minute radiation fallout forecast for Monday evening, January 16, 2012. The areas with the highest potential for radiation fallout based on current radar, jet stream forecasts, and precipitation tables are as follows. In Canada, current radar from the Weather Office at Environment Canada shows light rain at the present time from Vancouver through Calgary. The heaviest rain is occurring right now between Windsor and Toronto, moving east. Additional rainfall may develop over British Columbia and Alberta over the next 72 hours. Canada will be spared of most of the jet stream movement for the next 48 hours, but that may change starting Wednesday night. In the U.S., an unusual jet stream pattern will be touching upon northern Alaska, However, most of the precipitation will be located east of Alaska in the Yukon Territories and Northwest Territories. Hawaii will be spared of jet stream activity. In the continental U.S., the jet stream will be covering every state with the exception of Florida. NOAA three-day precipitation tables indicate heavy rain for Washington, Oregon, and the northern half of California. Heavy rain will also be occurring in Idaho, northern half of Utah in the western portion of Montana. Mild to moderate rain is expected from eastern Texas through Maine over the next 72 hours. In Europe, light rain is forecasted for the eastern coastal regions of Spain, all of Ireland, and the eastern half of Germany, with scattered light rain for the rest of eastern Europe. Snow is expected for Austria and the Czech Republic. Due to the continuing releases and uncertainty about the status of Reactor 2 and 4 and heavy rain, my biggest concern over the next three days is the Pacific Northwest of the United States. Please avoid any contact with rainfall, and if you do get rain on your skin, shower as soon as possible and use baking soda as a decontaminant. For more information about mitigation, please visit FukushimaFacts.com and for links to the current fallout graphs for the U.S. and Europe. This forecast has been brought to you by Radchick and the Orion Talk Radio Network. We care about you because your government doesn't. Please care for others as well. Stay safe.